Hello, I'm Mark Savard, and welcome to a Motivational Minute. 60 Seconds starts now. As a professional hypnotist for over two decades, I've probably said the word sleep more than almost anyone on this planet. And trust me, I love my sleep. But like so many other people, work, social life, kids, and stress can make it hard to get what I need. Did you know that sleep accounts for one quarter to one third of the human lifespan? But lots of us aren't getting what we need, and it can have serious consequences. According to the Center for Disease Control, one in three Americans don't get enough sleep. And lack of quality of sleep is connected to poor overall health, mood disorders, low productivity, and it increases the risk of developing chronic conditions such as obesity, diabetes, high blood pressure, heart disease, and strokes. And we all know that feeling of getting up on the wrong side of bed. Those sleep-deprived bad moods are real. When you aren't getting good sleep, your brain treats negative influences like Velcro and positive ones like Teflon. In one study, sleep-deprived college students remembered 81% of negative words presented to them, but only 31% of the positive ones. So I think we can all agree that getting good sleep is extremely important. But what can you do if you're having uh, one of those hard time catching Z's type moments for years and years? Well, here's some tips. Stick to a sleep routine. Try going to bed and waking up at the same time every day, even on the weekends. This will help you regulate your body clock. Turn off the screens an hour before bedtime. That means TV, computers, and yes, your cell phone. The light emitted from these screens suppresses melatonin and sends the wrong signals to your brain. Now, while power naps can be great, if you regularly have a hard time falling asleep at night, maybe try eliminating those and regularly exercise. Avoid alcohol late at night as it actually reduces REM sleep. And of course, anxiety is a huge factor for many people who toss and turn. Now, meditation is a great way to de-stress before bed. And last, but certainly not least, hypnosis is a great tool for training your brain to rest and relax. You can find a good hypnotherapist in your area by looking online or look for self-hypnosis audio programs. I've included a free downloadable link to mine if you want to check it out. Be sure to tag someone who you think might enjoy this message. And let me know how you're doing. Like, comment, share, retweet, and or follow. See you next week. When you're well rested, your health and quality of your life improves drastically. So if you're having a hard time, these strategies can help you reset your body clock and take back those Z's. Lock that into your mind and sleep. <laughs>